welcome to the Charleville School of Distance Education. We have prepped to year 10 students based all over southern Queensland. I'm going to give you a great big air high five. Some of our students are 400 kilometres from their nearest town. The technology that's used now, we have a teleconference lesson with the children in their groups. The teachers then go onto a web-based program uh, that they can use with the children one-on-one -on -one or as groups. The parents and or their home tutor are integral to the delivery. We live on a sheep and cattle property which is uh, 55,000 acres and it's 140 kilometres south of Charleville. The children uh, have an on-air lesson every day for half an hour, which is fantastic. The teacher um, goes through, they do maths or English. Uh, they also um, get to speak to their friends, which is the, the best part. School of Distance Education is very, very portable and with a lot of our programs being recorded now, if a child has a computer, they can do their program at any time, any place. So children who have the responsibility of helping with mustering, um, cattle, sheep, farming, whatever their job is at home, they can actually fit their schooling in around those times. So it's a very portable, a very unique and individual program for children. Charleville School of Distance Ed holds mini schools twice a year so that the children can come together and participate in activities that they cannot do when they're on their own. Group activities, problem solving activities, sporting teamwork and socialisation. I'm surprised I'm going to get wrapped in toilet paper. I'm really surprised. The, the most rewarding part of um, distance education is the students who you are dealing with are generally um, very keen to be there. Some of them are meeting for the first time. They might have heard their voice on their on-air lessons, but this is the first time they see face to face. I have a sister and when we wake up in the morning we have to go feed all our animals because there's lots of them. We live about five hours apart so we never really get to go visit each other. Yeah, at the start we feel a bit shy. And then... Yeah, but then we don't leave each other, we just play and we're just skipping at morning tea or at the breaks and yeah, we do all that sort of stuff. Seeing our teachers here is really great because you know you don't get to see them much and out where we are there's like no teachers. Yes, yeah, swimming. An important part of mini schools is swimming. A lot of them live in areas where the water holes or the dams are not safe for swimming and so it's great that they can have you know clear water and a pool experience. We, the other night we had this really funny book and we'd just sit there and read it together and Boyd would really like, laugh really hard <laughs> at all the really funny parts and yeah and we'd just talk and you know, that sort of stuff. Sunday night, I think it was. Oh, yeah, Sunday night, we talked for ages. We're best, best friends. friends. <laughs>